Mitch Ninjas, episode four, mm-hmm. and I uh, got something pretty cool to talk about. And you know, we kind of went with the Google Trends thing for a couple days, and that was cool. And then we got into stat checking, and now we're going to talk about alternatives from Google AdWords. Now I know, like most of you guys probably out there, hopefully if you don't, you should be doing like Yahoo and AdCenter. Though mm-hmm. really, I don't know how much. If, you know, like we talked, AdCenter actually has brought the highest conversion rate. Yeah, highest conversion is no traffic. No traffic, hardly. So yeah. if any of you guys have really mastered AdCenter, then... Call uh, me. Yeah, 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 call me. But, uh, yeah, so we're going to talk about a couple of different um, websites we've used to generate traffic that have done really well. So uh, the first one we were going to talk about is AdBrightness, A-D-B-R-I-T-E.com. Good. Yeah, but didn't I do good yeah. with that? A little bit nervous. Yeah, AdBright. Uh, I discovered AdBright when I did a actually a uh, placement report on my Google AdWords account, and that way you can determine where your traffic is going as far as the content side of Google AdWords, and which of those sites that you're advertising on, which ones are highly you know converting. Yeah. And so what I did is I found uh, through my query that uh, there was a certain site that um, was doing really well. And then I looked at this, uh, saw the site, saw that they were using a service called AdBright to advertise on their site. And um, basically, it's straight up uh, pay per click advertising, or you can do CPM, or you can do just a flat rate. This particular site, it was only uh, $10 a day, $70 a week. And it just so happened that my ad was. Even though it was on the bottom of the page, bottom of their site, it was uh, it was there, and it was on the, the first page, and it was a money maker, and um, it's a great way to. Use. See that you know because we were talking about this before we shot the video. I tried AdBright too, and for one point we were making a hundred dollars a day, and I had an employee working on. It. I wasn't actually doing it myself, but we we're making a hundred dollars a day. And but it was like constant having to manage it to watch the clicks. You know, like mm-hmm. cost per click of ten cents would work today and not tomorrow on the same site. But you yeah. made money on the flat rates, and that's an yeah. option. Unlike Google, Con- it's pretty much like a content network. It's right. like a website that just does content network on Google. You know, they put your you know put any ad that you have for a product on a web page out there, and there's web developers out there and website owners like yeah, you know, we'll host your ads and we'll give you money. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, so. We uh, never really could make it work. Like I said, hundred dollars a day, which isn't bad. That's net profit too. But it was like a constant battle. It wasn't worth the time. But that flat rate, mm-hmm. I think, is where it's at. Yeah. And also, not blindly going for uh, random domains, but doing the placement report, so you can find out where you're making money with Google on the content network. Yeah. And then doing that. Yeah, I don't suggest going to AdBright and saying, "All right, I want this demographic, and I want, you know, uh, this this category," and you, because AdBright has a lot of junk, a lot of just junky sites. We did it. that and we got screwed. Yeah, the, the, yeah. If you're going to use AdBright, know that the site you want to advertise on is on AdBright and then know that you have, uh, you're converting sales on that site. But it's just nice to have a secondary way because at times when, uh, you know, the Google slaps, there was one time where, you know, I had some, you know, money coming in from other areas other than Google, thank goodness. Yeah, at one and point you had, uh, I think, like, Google's 60, only Yeah, I got down to 64%. Yeah, uh, Google's always been like Google. almost 100% of my business, you know. Right, and which is, you know, how it goes with that, and yeah, things happen. Bigger, you know, yeah, but, um, doing it, so. uh, that's probably, you know, be it for today, and then we wrap it up, and then, uh, well, we'll talk, you, you got something? Well, I don't know, let's see, how, how long have we been doing this, probably? I think I got time to go ahead and do okay. what yeah. I was going to say, too. All right, sure. We're trying to decide if we want to break this down into two videos, which we'll throw a bunch yeah, of content out there and see. So, yeah, so AdBright, cool, got to watch it closely. For Anthony, it worked out better doing the flat fee thing. And uh, the other website I was going to mention that I actually did not find out about um, until a rep from Yahoo Search Marketing told me about it is yahoo.adready.com, and that's a d r e a d y dot com. And uh, right, one quick thing before we get in there, to get to this, you definitely you're going to probably be contacted by Yahoo and say, hey, here's your account representative. If you spend a little bit of money with them, I was spending like two fifty three hundred a day on this account and got an account representative, ended up making friends with the guy. I've been able to call him up and be like, look, off the record, am I going to get in trouble with double serving on Yahoo? And he's like, nah, man, but you know, between you know, you and me, like I've made a buddy, and that's really cool. I can like really ask him stuff, and he's not going to close my account if I ask him you know, something about double serving or something like that. So I recommend all you guys do that. And real quick, AdBright, killer for double serving. Google doesn't want you to have two Google accounts. 
advertising the exact same website on the content network. You know? And so if you go to like that website, CNN.com, and you have two ads on there, Google doesn't like it. But if you want to have one ad with AdBright, and then one ad with Google, mm -hmm. and then hopefully one with AdReady, yahoo.adready.com, yeah. you can triple serve and it's legal. So anyway, what AdReady is, is a banner network, just like these, uh, some of the really big banner, like ValueClick, I think is a huge one out there. It's a banner network, but I've dealt with a lot of banner ad stuff, and usually it's a minimum buy of around 5000 a month for a site, like TV Guide or something like that. But with AdReady, you can advertise on really big sites for $167 a day. And they have this cool template that actually makes your banner ad for you. So even if you did it and didn't really use AdReady, you could go get killer banners made for free. And they're like all flash animation, you know, mm -hmm. with animated GIFs and stuff like yeah. that. But anyway, so definitely check out AdReady. It's a great place to test banner ads and then not have to spend $5,000. You can do it for like 100 bucks a day. And yeah, 167 is their minimum. But they advertise just Yahoo sites or is it? No, yeah, they do uh, two different networks. The Yahoo network, which is um, like their content network, and then they do another one called uh, Right Media, which mm -hmm. is really big, has much more reach, and you get cheaper yeah. traffic. And the cool thing is, most banner ads will have like a minimum of $2 CPM or something like that for TV Guide. I've actually advertised with them. It was like $2, and it was like $3 CPM. It's really expensive you know, to, to advertise with them. But you can say, look, I'm not going to pay more than a dollar CPM with that ready. You might not get any traffic, but you can at least get mm -hmm. them really low just yeah. for the content network. Strata. So. Yeah, so that's uh, two two websites to try out, Ad Bright and Ad Ready. Both yeah. of them are really killer. So. All right, great. It's a nice call. All right, we better get that. Ad Center. <laughs> yeah, so what's going yeah. on Ad Center right now? All right, now? well, uh, we'll check you guys out next time. Yeah, so and then, yeah, uh, look out for tomorrow. Hopefully we'll put those we'll links, Ad Bright and Ad Ready, we'll put those on under the uh, video here. So, uh, anyway, see you next time. Cool. Thanks. Thanks.